Our top story this morning. Senior officials from North Korea and the United States have concluded three days of talks in Sweden aimed at breaking the impasse over denuclearization and as the two countries prepare for another summit between their leaders. The world now awaits the announcement of the exact date and venue of the second summit between Kim Jong-un and President Trump. Kim Hyo-sun starts us off. North Korea and the U.S. ended their three-day working-level talks in Sweden to prepare for the second summit between their leaders. U.S. Special Representative Stephen Began left the convention located in a remote area northwest of Stockholm Monday morning local time. Arriving at a hotel in the Swedish capital, Began said he had a nice meeting with his counterpart. Uh, have you had a nice talk? Was it nice? Sorry. Later in the day, a vehicle carrying North Korea's vice foreign minister Choi Son hee also left the venue. South Korea's chief nuclear envoy Lee Do Hoon also took part in the three way talks to seek a breakthrough on denuclearization. Although little is known about the outcome of the meeting as of now, the fact the meeting ended earlier than anticipated could signal that significant progress was made. As the delegations of the three countries are scheduled to leave Sweden on Tuesday, there's also the possibility of them sitting down for additional talks in Stockholm. Now all eyes are on what steps Pyongyang and Washington will take before their leaders meet face-to-face -face late next month. Kim Hyo-sun, Arirang News.